What about you? Robbie from Primary Lawns here, right in the country today doing a bit of a hedge cutting job, so stick around. We arrived at the property and this little thing's buzzing about cutting the grass. If, for you guys that don't know what this is, this is a Husqvarna robot lawnmower. In my opinion, these things are the future. They're going to slowly replace us guys that are out cutting grass. I think the biggest thing that's holding them up is the price of them. But over time, they're getting cheaper and cheaper. Then uh, more and more people will start to be using them. Anybody that's been living under this for the last couple of years, these things are just little battery powered uh, lawnmowers. They cut the garden, they don't cut the garden in any sort of shape. They just how they install them, they put a wire the whole way around the garden, and that just comes up to an edge. And whenever it hits something, it just turns and it goes in another direction. They don't cut in any sort of logical form, they just cut round and round, and eventually cut all the grass and then they'll return back to their base automatically. This is the heads we're cutting here today. It's mostly Leilandi with a few other evergreens thrown in for a good measure. The tools being used today are mostly the Deco Long Reach Hedge Colours. They're the 265 HCA Hedge Colours. Uh, and the thing about back, for anybody that doesn't know, is a henchman easy lift harness, uh, seven month, model 717. I bought the uh, easy lift harness as I have problems with my back. Then I was at the stage, I either drop the heads cutting or find another way to do it. And uh, I must say, since I bought this, this thing's been amazing. This is a fairly big hedge. And it's, as you can see, it's quite high. It's this height for quite a number of meters. Uh, I cut this, all this hedge, both sides of it, um, on this day. And I went home with very, very little fatigue. So at the end of the day, that's really what you want if you're self-employed is, is not to have any pains at the end of the day. Something that's really common in our game is back pain and shoulder pain. And I hear from other gardeners through network groups that have had to give up hedge cutting and different jobs all the time. And I think this tool really fills that niche. If you suffer from back pain or shoulder pain, then this is what you want to get if you're hedge cutting. I bought this from henchman.co.uk. It's not a sponsored product. I bought it with my own money. Uh, I'm under no obligation to say whatever I like about it, just to sort of make that clear. This is a lawn that I treat on a regular basis. Whenever you're treating the lawn and you're using one of these robot lawnmowers, it leaves a really nice finish. Big boys and their toys. This is a John Deere 583 tractor with a PTO German grass cutting unit on the back. I suggested the client would be getting some grass cutting tires put on. Turns out they're more expensive than a Honda HRH 536 lawnmower. Just cutting the rear side of this hedge. It's in the field. This side of the hedge just hasn't had as much TLC and, and that's just why it's not as tight as, as the rest of the hedge. But I only started to cut it last year or two, so hopefully the next couple of years it'll start to really thicken up like the, like the rest of the hedges. So if you've enjoyed this video, if you could hit that like button down below, if you can really, really smash it, really helps my channel and helps me grow and subscribe.
have another good video that features the easy lift harness, how to be a gardener, a week in the life. I'll put that at the end. Make sure you check that out next. Thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next video.